is it for the cases on our agenda. However, we do have a bit of other business that we need to attend to tonight. Um, the first being the joint ordinance. Um, all of the commissioners, you should have received a final draft of the new joint ordinance. As you know, we've been operating under an ordinance that's well over 20 years old and does not um, seem to apply to um, the new uh, planning commission. So there has been a proposal to update this and you have the draft in front of you. I'm hoping that each of you have had a moment to take a look at this since you've had it a few days. Um, the way this will work is the Planning Commission will vote um, to accept this draft and if that motion is passed, then it will then move forward to the individual municipalities for them to do their due diligence um, and come back to us with feedback, pass it on to their attorneys um, so that we can move forward. This new joint ordinance does include the city of Ringerton who has asked to join the commission. So we'll take that into account. Are there any questions? If not, we need a motion to approve the final draft and move it forward to the um, independent municipality. That's to transmit it as a draft. As a draft. Staff or some staff have some Concerns about the language in here, things that are in, things that are omitted. Okay. What concerns do you have? Now? Well, one, I mean, it's just a housekeeping thing. Section number 11 is missing in its entirety off of page 4. There's discussion in here about a budget for the planning commission. Mm -hmm. um, since the RDC staff got defunded, mm -hmm. there has not been a budget for the planning commission. I would say that one can't be created. But I think it should be very clear here as to who is the keeper of those funds and those accounts and the bookkeeping and so forth. Okay. Now, it might become tricky with five separate local governments of our members. Okay, so section 14 reads, the Lowndes County Planning Office shall provide administrative assistance to the commission necessary for the performance of the commission's duties and responsibilities including making arrangements for commission members to attend training seminars, coordinating and overseeing the provision of local training opportunities for commission members, preparing media agenda, taking and preparing minutes for commission meetings, maintaining and distributing journals and other publications to commissions, members, and keeping various records for the commission. Um, that in itself does not address expenses. However, 13 does. My understanding, and I know since I've been here, uh, we have not been, um, we have not participated in the creation of the budget for the, for the Greater Lands Planning Commission. That's because there is one. There is one. Okay. So if there is no budget, then our expenses should be taken care of from the independent municipalities? The, the, the expenses for each member, mm -hmm. okay, like for training or any bikes or anything else, those are borne by the member of government who appointed said member. Right. Yeah. Okay. In terms of providing the meeting space, mm -hmm. that is by Lyons County, and that is by agreement between Lyons County and Valdosta as to who is the keeper of the planning commission, who is the keeper of the other joint board, which is in the board of appeals. Right. Um, and that is addressed in section two. Right. And though that is, by the agreement, is absorbed in the departmental budgets of the planning and zoning offices for those two governments. Okay. It's not a set lease for the city. There is no separate line item for planning All right. So we just, for ZDOA expenses, we bring them under the umbrella. Okay. Um, in this draft, the budget is described in 13, 14, and 15. And the county <coughs> staff wants to be the keeper of the budget and propose an annual budget and so forth. That's one way to handle it is the keeping staff of the planning commission. Mm -hmm. This needs to be clarified in here. Okay. Um, another thing for budgets is to win a start date. Like when do we start creating a budget and keeping up with funds and so forth. Most local governments have now adopted or are about to adopt their next year's fiscal year budget. Mm -hmm. One other detail, just to be the devil's advocate, a pirate does not follow the same fiscal year as everybody else. Right. So that adds another wrinkle. Um, those things ought to be considered. Okay. Um, and while I'm on okay. the floor, um, in the beginning, under the whereas statements, 
Yes. I would include a statement that the city of Bremerton has petitioned or formally petitioned to join the planning commission <coughs> and that one of the purposes of this joint ordinance is to add the city of Bremerton. It's not clear in here. It says five governments and all of a sudden the city of Bremerton is in the list. So you want to continue? I would just clarify that preamble language. You want that in the whereas, not in the therefore. Correct. Uh, or even a second whereas statement, whereas the city of Remington has formally petitioned to join the Grand Rounds Planning Commission. Okay. okay. I mean, it's part of the history of how right. we got to this point. I mean, okay. we described the 96 ordinance to five member governments. Now we have a petition to add number six. Okay. I would just state that in here rather than imply it. Okay. Well, since we have changes, do we want to uh, make have these changes made and forward on, or do we want to have these changes made and have it brought back in front of the commission? Madam Chair, as he stated, it's just a draft anyway. So Correct. We'll get a revised draft before we do that. I would turn it over to you to do the work. Okay. Okay. I mean, it's either make the changes, send it on as a draft, and get the fee book now, or redraft and bring it back to you. I just need to delay it. What does the majority wish to do? Okay. All right. Well, we have a motion that we have the corrections and the, and the changes made. And the authors, the county staff, and the authors, the county staff. The language on how they want to report the budget. So. Right. Okay. Um, and if I'm um, allowed to work with Trini, if y'all give me that option to work with Trini to make sure that that wording is placed in there properly. And then once that's done, we can forward it on to the member governments. Yeah, we will. Okay. So the changes we're waiting for will be made between. Correct. Those changes can be made, and we'll work with Matt on the language of the budget before we forward it to the member government. And, so you will email us a copy and then you will be emailed a copy okay. before we send it on to the member government. It's just for you to have one last look. I think we're going to get a variety of comments from the six governments. I'm sure we will. Oh, we'll, 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 we'll have a lot more to talk about at the next meeting. Okay. So, so is this not been spread out over the six governments as perhaps yet? No, Correct. it's coming before you first. Yes. Okay. All right. So that's what we'll do. We need a motion to that effect. Okay. All right. So we have a motion that the changes will be made second, and move on. Okay. We have it seconded. All right. All those in favor, raise your right hand. All those opposed. Okay. That carries.